answer becomes three, maybe four, maybe five. But the typical teacher would say, no, Susie, the answer is two. But the typical teacher would never ask what Susie was just doing when she did what I just showed you. I'll show you again. She's learned something that has nothing to do with basic mathematics. Her mommy and her daddy made her. That's three. Then her little brother Tommy and her little brother Bobby. That's five. So one and one equals five in her house. Now, is that a correct answer? Yes. Not in mathematics, but it is a correct answer in family planning. If it was one female fly or mosquito, let's take mosquito, one female mosquito and one male mosquito, it wouldn't take long before you had hundreds or thousands. You had a teacher that was trying to make her or his teaching a little interesting by using props and had no budget. Like many school systems in the world, they have no budgets and huge classes, almost as big as this, for one teacher. And the teacher holds up a banana and perhaps a coconut. Says, what do I have? Well, the teacher's looking for two fruit. But one of the students is probably going to say, you have the beginning of a fruit salad. <laughs> Sometimes it gets a laugh, sometimes it doesn't. Didn't that time. But that little boy will end up in the corner of his classroom. And one of the reasons my friends used to say I became an architect was because I spent so much time in the corners of my classrooms as a young child. Because I was always the one who came up with 